Okay. As you guys are finding your way to your seats and getting all your stuff out and ready to go. Yes. Start here in a second. Not so breath. much. <laughs> We allowed to use calculators? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. All right. Perfect. All right. Oh, hey, Lord. Did I tell you when you were working at McDonald's in Puerto Rico? Congrats. Starting on the 27th. Good interviews then. I know, right? Alright. Perfect. Well then they're kinda of looking for some sixteen year olds to work there now. Yeah. Alright. Uh, hopefully your name's on. Make sure you put your name on if you haven't already. Start with that. Alright, let's go through the instructions and then once we're through the instructions then you can go ahead and work. Again, you get two days, you get today and tomorrow if you want. If you finish it today, that's fine. I'm gonna hand it back to you no matter what tomorrow and you can take one more look at it. Um, you have to find the number of shaded blocks on that. Um, make sure they're writing that fraction, shaded over total. Or give me the decimal and the percent. You have to give me three parts on that one. Number two, you can do it either by proportion or you know convert to the algebraic way where it like is as an equal sign, that type of thing. Um, you have to solve for the number. Um, three, you have to figure out what your sale is going to be and what you're saving. So that's a discount. So remember how you do discounts. Four, no, you have a lot of words in the word bank there. I believe there is 20 words in the word bank. You're only going to use 15 of them. And you're only going to use the word once. So there's extra words you will not use. Okay? So that one's going to take a little more skill. It's just the shapes, basically. Uh, number five, you have to give me the names of those objects. If, if one of them happens to be an angle, you have to give me what specific type of angle it is, and then measure it with your protractor. Okay? You can extend the walls further if you need to, to measure that. Six, you have to draw an angle using your protractor. So you do need a protractor in front of you to draw that angle accurately. Okay. Uh, number seven, you have to measure that in millimeters. So like so many centimeters, so many millimeters. Okay. Uh oh. I was waiting for you to <laughs> All right. Number eight. Uh, the perimeter of that object, remember perimeter is the distance all the way around, that is a, that is a rectangle. Uh, nine, you have to find the volume of that, okay? Um, ten and eleven, you're drawing those in inches. Um, be accurate, you have to go to the right marker on your, on your ruler, okay? All right, take your time. There's only eleven questions here. Um, you get it done today, that's fine, you can turn in, you can work on where you need to quietly. Um, I know there's a ton of other tests this week, so you can study for that. Um, but I'll hand it back to you tomorrow, no matter what tomorrow, so you can take one more look, and then Thursday I'll get them back graded so you can see what your grades are. Okay, we're good? Good. Rest time's yours. Work at your own pace.